What is up, guys? Welcome back to Prepix. Today is Sunday, June 9th, and I have an NBA parlay for you guys tonight for Game 2 of the Finals. Boston is hosting the Mavericks, and I'm really excited about this. I also have a couple of great offers for you guys that I'm going to go over as well. Um, now, as always, I am putting this together on Sleeper, um, but you can also put this together on Chalkboard. Um, there are two alternate lines in this parlay, but I did make sure that they are available on both apps. So whichever one you want to use, you can take advantage. If you use the promo code PRE on Sleeper or Chalkboard, you do get a deposit match of up to $100. I highly recommend you get on that. That is the easiest way to make money betting on sports. Sign-up bonuses, deposit matches, free bets, things like that. That's the most guaranteed way. So I highly recommend you get on as many apps as you can. Even if you don't use those apps long-term, just get the deposit match or get that sign-up bonus. Uh, roll it over so you can withdraw it. And it's easy as that. Um, I you know I only have Sleeper on the page here because I don't have a graphic for a chalkboard. But they're also great as well. Um, I do like both apps. They both have their advantages. Sleeper, I think, is better for new users because the, they both have the deposit match but sleeper does have these daily free squares um for today if you're a new user you get a free jalen brown square he just needs a uh, half a point um they have these every day for new users i always promote them um so i highly recommend that chalkboard i like as well chalkboard has great daily flash bonuses or flash discounts on lines they are if you're somebody who is betting on sports every day or you're trying to you know get into sports betting you're trying to generate consistent profit i highly recommend chalkboard because those flash sales are excellent they're not quite as good as having a free square like half a point for Jalen brown but they have some awesome offers anyway um, one that i love today is luka Doncic over 36 pra um, if you're familiar with the mavericks or you're familiar with Doncic, you know how easy that is he could easily clear that in points alone I would say anything less than like 45 PRA for Doncic is probably a bad game at this point, especially in the finals. Uh, but for Sleeper also today, for all new users, I'm sorry, for all users, period, they do have a free square as well for Jason Tatum just have a half point. So I highly recommend you get on that. There's no downside. It's half a point. Tatum and Jalen Brown both get. Probably going to get that in the first minute. <laughs> um, but yeah, without further ado, let me get right into the picks um, and let's get started. So the first play I have here is Daniel Gafford over 7.5 points. Now what I love about Daniel Gafford is that he's very consistent minutes-wise. If we come down here to his minutes per game, you can see over his last 10 games, he averages 22.2. Over his last 5, 23.2. 15, 22.4. And 30, 22.2. He's very consistent minute-wise, especially since he joined the Mavericks uh, from the Wizards earlier this season. Um, as you can see also, he hits this points line with frequency uh 14 of his last 15 i'm sorry excuse me 13 of his last 15 games 13 of his last 14 really um but yeah i mean the thing with the mavericks are with their big men the more minutes they play the more points they're going to get i know that sounds simple but let me explain a bit better obviously the mavericks two focal points on offense are luka Doncic and Kyrie irving so their big men aren't going to be they're never going to have plays called for them aside from you know pick and roll or pick and pop but they do tend to get their points off of offensive rebounds, putbacks, lobs from Kyrie and Luka. And those just kind of generally happen throughout the game. So the more point minutes they play, the more opportunities they have, and they do just tend to get more points as their minutes go up. Again, it sounds simple, but there is some logic behind it. Um, I was also considering the points and assists line for Gafford, which is actually not at 7.5, it's actually at 8.5. I like that as well. Um, I'm going to do the points line myself, but the points and assists line may be a bit safer just because you're kind of hedging your bet. Um, so you only need him to get a single assist to help with that points line, and, you know, he cuts it close with both. Um, he had nine points and assists last game, and he's eight and a half. He had eight points last game, and he's seven and a half. Um, you know, he tends to get an assist in most of his games, so you're just kind of hedging your bet, um, but I personally like the points line more. Next play I have here is P.J. Washington over nine and a half points. This is actually an alt line. Um, the traditional line is at 12 and a half for him. But this alt line is available both on sleeper and chalkboard, so don't worry about that. Um, another guy whose minutes are very consistent, and he actually gets quite a bit more um, than Daniel Gafford. You can see 35.1 over his last 30 games, 36.7 over his last 15, 38 over his last 10, 38.3 over his last 5. His minutes are just going up. His production is great. He had 14 points game one. And obviously, as you can see, he hits, he hits this line with regularity. 24 of his last 30 games. He's another guy who Dallas needs to play well if they want to win, and they definitely want to bounce back from that game one disaster. Finally, the last play I have here is 
Porzingis, over 19.5 PRA. Again, this is an alt line, but this is both on Stuper and Chalkboard. The numbers speak for themselves. Uh, 27 of his last 30 games, and this game here where he only had 10, that was a game where he got hurt against the Heat. And the thing with Porzingis is he is injury prone. Um, obviously, he missed most of these playoffs, and he came off the bench in game one. But when he does play, he does produce. Um, and if he gets hurt, the line will be avoided, and you're not going to lose anyway. So I think this is a great opportunity. Um, another thing for Porzingis is that I mean, this is the finals. And so they don't have anything to save him for. They're not going to have him on a minutes restriction. There's no team they have to play after this. this you know, it's kind of like win or go home. So as the series goes on, his minutes per game are going to increase because there's less season left. They just, there's nothing, again, there's nothing to save him for. They don't need to preserve his energy. They don't need to worry about the wear and tear as much. Now, I'm not saying they're going to run him into the ground, but he's going to slowly increase in minutes. He's going to increase in production. They're going to keep using him more. Um, and he's going to crush this line. As you can see, he crushes it with regularity uh, about almost 90% of the time on the year. Over his last 30 games, he averages almost 29 PRA. We only need him to hit 20. So another no-brainer. Uh, I love that line. So that's the main parlay, those three legs. Again, that's Daniel Gafford over 7.5 points, P.J. Washington over 10 points, or 10 or more points, and Porzingis 20 more PRA. Now, I do have two extra lines for you that I'm not putting in the parlay myself. They're just lines that I really like that I was considering putting in, but I try to keep it to two or three legs, so I'm not putting these in. But put them in if you'd like. Um, I recommend them. I vouch for them just as much as these three lines. It's just that I don't like to go over three in a particular bet. The first of those lines is Porzingis again, over three and a half first quarter points. Um, now on Sleeper, this is actually at four and a half, so it's not quite as good, but I still like this line a lot. I'd highly recommend it. Um, but on, on Chalkboard, it is at three and a half. Um, now Porzingis is coming off the bench, which is, I think, why this line's a little artificially low. But here's the thing. When Porzingis comes into the game, it's go time. They're not bringing him in to sit in the corner. They're not bringing him in to just run suicides and play defense. When Porzingis comes in the game, they're putting him in the pick and roll. They're putting him in pick and pops. They're getting him the ball, and they're giving him opportunities to score. As you can see, obviously, last game he had 11 points in the first quarter. He took over as soon as he came in the game. He's not somebody who's going to be passive on the court. His presence is going to be known, especially on offense. So I love this line a lot at 3.5 or 4.5. Frankly, they could realistically put this line at like 5, 5.5, and, and it would still be good. <laughs> um, the last play here is... You know, it's minor. It's not, you're not gonna. It's not gonna make you a millionaire. It's just something you can add in. Um, you know, for a little extra odd boost. Um, but I have Kyrie under one block. Um, Kyrie, you know, doesn't get a lot of blocks. Obviously, two in his last ten, nine of his last thirty. And one thing I like is that Boston is first in blocks allowed per game, so they don't get blocked very often. They get blocked less than any team in the league. And obviously, Kyrie Irving's not known for his shot blocking prowess, so. Just another line you can add in. Again, that's on sleeper and chalkboard. Um, you know, I like that as well. But again, I try to limit my plays to three, so I didn't put it in this today. But I wanted to share it with you guys. Uh, so again, put this together on sleeper or chalkboard. Use the promo code PRE on either one. You get that $100 deposit match. The link to both are in my bio. And you get these free picks from sleeper, uh, Jalen Brown for new users, and Jason Tatum for all users. Now what I would do, because for these picks... The Jalen Brown play, you can put up to $20 on it. The Jason Tatum, you can put up to $10 on it. Um, they just kind of limit you so that way, you know, you're not putting $500 on a free bet. So what I would do, um, combined with the offer that I'm about to show you guys, is I would put $15 down, on, at least $15 on Sleeper. Um, you know, you get the deposit match, then you have 30 Then you put 20 on Jalen Brown, 10 on Jason Tatum. Now you have to be careful, because... You want to put the Jalen Brown play in first, because that is for first-time users. So if you sign up and then you put the Jason Tatum play in first, the Jalen Brown play Jalen Brown play goes away, because it's not your first play anymore. So make sure that if you're a new user, you put the Jalen Brown play in first before you do the Jason Tatum. Now, for all users on Sleeper or Chalkboard. If you put in a deposit match of at least $10 and use my promo code PRE, I will send you $15, no matter what. So if you put in 10 you put in 15 you put in 100 
I will send you $15. So, what I recommend you guys do, um, just a quick reminder of what you get with Sleeper and everything. If you put in $15, I will send you $15, and then you're getting these plays for free. So, you get the Jalen Brown play, the Jason Tatum play. You can play both of them maxed out, $20 on one, $10 on the other. Both of these plays, when you put them together with the extra square, are a 5.3 time multiplier. So, essentially, you get a free shot at $150 or so, a little more than $150. Uh, I think it's about $159. Um, so, that's just a free chance. All you got to do is sign up for Sleeper, use my promo code, then you get a free chance. Um, now, on Chalkboard, do the same thing. You don't have to put in 15 because you don't have these picks on sale. Um, you do have that free Luka play, or the uh, Luka discount that I mentioned earlier, but it's just, you know, it's, it's a regular play. Um, but in putting at least $10, I will send you $15 as a thank you. And then also, you'll get a free week of my VIP picks. Now, if you're not familiar with my VIP picks, I've been tracking them since November, and I'm up over 290 units since November, with only two losing weeks the entire time. So if you're a hundred dollar better, you would have turned that you would have be up twenty nine thousand dollars by now if you have hundred dollar units, two hundred and ninety units since November. So again, get in, use my promo code, get the free week. I will give you a free week for each app. So if you do ten dollars on Sleeper and ten dollars on Jockboard, you're getting two free weeks of VIP. You get up to two hundred dollars in deposit match. You get the free Jason Tatum play, the free Jalen Brown play. You get thirty dollars sent to you from me, and you get. Um, well, yeah, that's, that's what you get. Um, on Chalkboard, also, they, like I said, they have the daily flash promotions, like the Luka Doncic play, 36.5 PRA. That's incredible. They have plays like that every single day, so I highly recommend you take advantage. Um, yeah, let me know in the comments what you guys think, what your favorite plays are for today, and uh, yeah, if you guys are going to tell. Um, all the details are in the description, the, all my sign-up codes, the links, uh, the links to the picks. Um, and ways to show me, because when, when you do sign up with my promo code, I just need you to send me a copy of a picture of, you know, of you using the code, and then I'll send you all, everything. I'll send you the $15. I'll send you the free picks. Um, yeah, but again, let me know what you guys think. Um, let me know your favorite plays for tonight in the comments. I love to hear your feedback. I like and reply to every comment, and I will see you guys again next time. See ya.